Hi, welcome to my channel and another video on the Arduino Uno microcontroller platform. In this video I'm taking a break from the project book experiments to have a little fun with an example I came across on the Arduino website. While reading about the arrays in the last experiment I noticed this example titled Knight Rider and just had to go ahead and build it. It's not a complex circuit, just six LEDs and current limiting resistors connected to output pins two through seven. The, the sketch is where we'll produce the iconic visual effect associated with the Knight Rider Pontiac Trans Am. Remember that fluid motion of lights going back and forth on the front? There are three sketches to try. Uh, the first one accomplishes a good result with just brute force, it's, a, it's longer than the other two. The second sketch reduces the code by using arrays that we introduced in the last experiment. And the last sketch refines the timing of the LEDs so you get that more fluid motion. So I've been following the experiments in the Arduino project book that came with the starter kit. And I bought a couple of other books off of Amazon, but I forgot, you know, the best resource to really go to is the Arduino website and it's just loaded with tons of examples and tutorials and that's how I, I came across this Knight Rider example that I needed to try. So if you go to references here I was I was looking up uh, the explanation and examples of uh, array it's under data type here and down here at the bottom I noticed the uh, reference to Knight Rider example so here's uh, the circuit. It's pretty straightforward with six LEDs and six current limiting resistors. And uh, there's three sketches here and each one improves uh, the visual effect. You can see this is pretty long. It's pretty pretty simple. It just goes ahead and uh, declares each one of these pins two through seven. And then you go ahead and use pin mode and declare them as outputs and then alternate alternate the high and low on those LEDs and it's just a pretty like I said brute force long way to go about doing it uh, the second one we make use of an array and it really shortens the program of the sketch you can see here we use digital write pin array And then finally the third one uh, refines the timing so you get more of a fluid motion. So let's go upload the first sketch and take a look at what the LEDs look like when they're alternately turning on and off. So let me upload the first sketch and we'll take a look to see how those LEDs light. There you go, it's it's close, but it's not exactly how I remember the the kit car visual effect on the front of the dash. Let me turn the light off briefly, a little bit of the light. Yeah, I saw this reference to the uh Night Rider car and I just had to build the circuit. Sometimes you just have to take a break. Not really going into the code too much. Just needed to build this circuit to... I had the components, you know, it's just LEDs and the resistors. Why not give it a try? Okay, now let's try the program that now utilizes an array. And see how that compares. You can see the LEDs on the end seem to be blinking twice. And now let's do the, the third sketch, which really improves makes it uh, 
more fluid motion and, and what you remember from the Knight Rider series. Yeah, that's that's closer. You know, sometimes you just want to build a circuit, get it running for the fun of it, before getting into the details. And remember that the Arduino website really is the best resource out there for the Arduino. So thanks for watching, and please subscribe and or comment. And see you next video. I need the sound effect for this.